In today's video, we'll examine three of the most fuel-efficient twin-engine general aviation aircraft that you can still find in the market. Brace yourselves for a short but exciting episode as we talk about their current price, technical specifications, performance numbers, and other interesting features that made a significant contribution to their inclusion here in our list. Fuel economy is one of the most engaging talking points in aviation. Since this is among the few things that pilots have some level of control over, it goes without saying that fuel expenses can be cut significantly by adjusting power and other flight profile settings. And for those looking to buy a plane, fuel consumption is obviously a key factor, as this directly correlates with the aircraft's operating costs. Thus, finding a general aviation aircraft with the right fuel economy for the speed, range, and payload capacity expected from it it is critical in any successful mission. There are also many factors to consider when discussing fuel economy, such as the type of engine used, cruising speed, cabin space, useful load, and of course, the individual's pilot's technique. This makes it clear that certain aircraft models have some advantage over others. And that's what we would like to tackle in this episode. This is Aviation Federation sharing with you exciting information about the latest and greatest in aviation and beyond. We'll start the list at number 3 with the Piper PA-44 Semino. This aircraft may now be considered a legacy model, but it remains current with the upgraded power plants, improved handling capabilities, and the new Garmin G1000 NXI flight deck. It's powered by twin Lycoming IO360 B1G6 engines with a flat rated horsepower of 180 each, achieving a maximum cruise speed of 162 knots and a maximum range of 700 nautical miles. It has a fuel capacity of 108 gallons, a maximum takeoff weight of 3,800 pounds, and a standard useful load of 1,191 pounds. Its reported fuel consumption rate is 12.2 nautical miles per gallon, making it among the standard multi-engine aircraft used in many flight schools around the world. The Piper Seminole boasts a long list of avionics equipment options, including Garmin Synthetic Vision, Advanced Traffic Advisory System, Safe Flight Angle of Attack or AOA system, and even autopilot. This aircraft features ergonomic controls, comfortable seats, and highly durable components that make it an exceptional choice for owner pilots. The cabin uses heavy-duty vinyl and wear-resistant letters designed to beat the test of time, and air conditioning is also available as an option. Additionally, the turbo variant of the Piper Seminole is reported to reach around 168 knots of cruise speed over a distance of 800 nautical miles at around 60 to 65 percent power, giving it a fuel burn rate of 19 gallons per hour of economy cruise. This aircraft has a base price of 660,000 US dollars. At number 2, we have the Diamond DA62. Its two 2.0-liter Astra engine AE300 turbocharged common rail injection diesel engines provide 180 horsepower and can travel at a top speed of 192 knots of true airspeed. With its main tank holding 50 gallons and the auxiliary tank holding 36.5 gallons, it has a reported fuel capacity of 86.4 gallons per 576 pounds. At 60% power and at its maximum altitude, it may burn up to about 10.4 gallons of fuel every hour, with some estimates reporting about 12.6 nautical miles per gallon. The maximum takeoff weight of this aircraft is 4,407 pounds, which already takes into account the useful load of 1,299 pounds and its six-passenger seating capacity.
it can fly farther and quicker on less fuel, and it can also ascend quickly to high altitudes, as high as 12,000 feet at a rate of 1,028 feet per minute. Apart from its beautiful exteriors, its extra-large interior and roomy adjustable main seats, it is definitely a pilot and passenger's dream aircraft. In terms of key features and innovations, the first and most crucial layer of defense, its active safety features have also been integrated with various new sensors and systems throughout to assist in preventing accidents before they even happen. In case the unexpected occurs, its passive safety mechanisms were primarily designed to reduce the likelihood and severity of the injury to the pilot and passengers. The DA-62 has a base price of 1.3 million US dollars. Before moving on to the number one spot, please remember to leave a thumbs up and comment down below. It only takes a few seconds and it really helps to grow our community. Last but definitely not the least, we chose the Technum P2006 D. With its aluminum airframe, this aircraft is very light and achieves an incredible payload to total weight ratio. It's powered by twin Rodox 912 S3 engines with two bladed constant speed full feathering MT propellers, delivering 100 horsepower each. It can reach a maximum cruise speed of 145 knots and a maximum operating altitude of 14,000 feet. Its fuel tank capacity is 52.8 gallons, a useful load of 906 pounds, and a maximum takeoff weight of 2,712 pounds. The maximum range comes down to only 650 nautical miles, but fuel consumption is the top of its class with 9 gallons per hour, or about 17.8 nautical miles per gallon. The P2060 offers a superior high-wing configuration, making it stand out in terms of stability and handling, cabin visibility, as well as easy access for passengers and their luggage. The twin engines, of course, offers pilots with greater safety and peace of mind, but this is further enhanced by the built-in TAS-800 Garmin Traffic Advisory and Traffic Collision Avoidance Systems. The cockpit also features a twin screen G1000 NXI with an integrated autopilot system. The cabin is quite spacious with all the basic necessities and creature comforts as standard features. These details together with its retractable gear makes this not just a fuel-efficient aircraft but among the most value-packed aircraft in our list with a base price comparable to that of a single-engine aircraft at 625,000 US dollars. Now that you've seen our list of the most fuel-efficient twin-engine general aviation aircraft, which one do you think better deserves the top spot? Did we miss anything that deserves to be on this list? Do you have experience flying any of these? Which features and performance numbers caught your attention? Once again, this is Rick San, and you're watching Aviation Federation. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon to keep up to date with our latest videos. Thank you for watching and fly safe!